back to the trap and I'm flipping it. Double cup with the purple, I'm sipping it. Ay, ay. I might pull up where you stay. I might pull up, let it spray. What's YouTube is constant, and I'm back with another NBA 2K21 video. So right now we're starting off at the demo until the game drops on September 4th. But right now, what we can do is play 2KU five quick games, which I'm gonna get one of those in for you guys. But we're gonna go to the My Player Builder straight there, of course. So you know, let's see what 2K has in store for us. The first step in building your NBA 2K21 is selecting your look. See, I'm not gonna do the head scan data right now, but I'm just gonna pick up. They got the same faces from last year, man. Whatever. I'm gonna just pick this one. It's the same one I had last year. Stick with the same person. First name. Pretty sure you already know my name. Same name I have on my channel. But 2K always doesn't let me put in my last name. So I'm gonna just go with chocolate. Don't ask me why they don't let me put my last name. I don't know how to spell chocolate. Alright. Position. Alright, so the first thing I'm gonna do is uh a point guard good all y'all want to be point guards always like that jersey number we going with 22 that's my favorite number continue all right so now we get to select our build and this looks exactly the same as last year 2k20 but hey man we're gonna make the still we're gonna add one of the best builds we can do so we can have an all-around build right defense and shooting i'm not gonna do that i can do mostly playmaking I want to do playmaking and shooting. They have this pie chart. Yeah, playmaking and shooting. That's going to be my specialty. This is going to be the best. Y'all want to have that Steph Curry build? This is what you want. That Kyrie Irving build? This is what you want. That Damian Lillard build? This is what you want. Not that Russell Westbrook, that John Moran, that Donovan Mitchell. This is what you're going to want if you want to hit those shots and you want to cross people up. So what you're going to want to do is vertical is not so important, but it's not something that you're not going to need. What you want is some speed, some acceleration, and hmm, I can prioritize agility and low strength, low vertical. I can do agility and strength, and I'm not that much slower. I can do agility and vertical. I think I want to do agility and vertical. You know, I'm going to do all agility. Now, the reason I'm doing this is because... Even my vertical on 74, I'm not a slasher, so I'm not going to be dunking on people. I'm not going to be doing any of that. What? No, 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 no. All right, so keep your agility 74, and the reason for this is that you can still be able to dunk the ball, but you're not going to be dunking on people. So times when you're going to lay it up and miss, you're going to be able to dunk it. So keep this agility, right? Now to set my potential, we're going to go first right here to the shooting. Oh, come on. I didn't try to do that. Max out mid-range, 90. Max out three-point, 87. So here's the thing. If you put your free throw up, look how many more badges you're going to get. You're going to get four more. If I do this, I'm going to get the four. And I'm going to get 25. So we're going to keep that max for now. And we're going to come back to it. We need the playmaking badges, though. So our ball handling is maxed out. Our pass accuracy, maxed out. Now, what we need is something on the inside. Our driving lamp has to be maxed out. We're going to look for our vitals first. Lateral quickness, max it. Of course, perimeter defense, max it. Our steel, we're going to max that too. I know you don't think it's important, but you're going to need them cookies, man. You're going to need the cookies. Let me see how much to get one more defensive badge. We're going to have to spend a lot, so I don't think we're going to do that. Come on. I want to see if I can get one more defensive badge. No, it'll cost too much. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna leave it at the minimum for two, and then we're gonna come back and rearrange stuff. So we have a lot of playmaking and shooting, so I think that's good. Right now we just need to get our finishing up. Now I don't need post hook, driving dunk. It can go to 64. So hmm, I think I'm still gonna be able to dunk the ball. I really don't know. So should I go back and change my physical? That's the real question. And I think the answer for that is yes. Actually, no, I didn't pick my height yet. So leave your driving dunk on max. Close shot, you have to max it out. You don't think it does anything, but trust me, it does. And standing dunk. All right, so this right here, I'd say is the best build you can have. 
if I drop my ball handling by one point, I lose a playmaking badge. I think I can actually deal with that. If I lower my post fade, all right, I can keep at it at 25. If I lower it to 78, I can keep this to 20. And am I gonna get more finishing? No, all right, so I, it really makes no sense to do this. Just keep it at two. Defense, can I get more than that? All right, so I'm gonna put this back into playmaking. I'm gonna put this, I'm not gonna put this in post feed. I'm gonna put it somewhere I'm gonna need it. So my, hmm, why is my rebounding up? I'd rather have a higher interior defense so I don't have chance of getting exposed. And then my block. Oh, uh, then I don't get the point. All right, this builder is tough, man. This builder is tough. You take one from here. All right. Man, I really wish you could just, you know, do it how it was in the old days. But if I have to put my rebounding up, I'd rather put defensive. That way I can get the ball in the fast break and be out of here. So we're going to keep it on three defensive badges, two finishing, 25 shooting, two making. Right here, this is the best build for a shooting playmaking point guard. Our body shape, I really do. Anything I'm gonna pick. I'm gonna pick built. It's like why not be built, right? Now my height. This is a big factor. See, you can be a six-eight point guard, right? My driving dunk only goes up by one. My standing dunk up by seven. My shooting drops. My handles drop. That's not a good idea. So let me see. Six foot five, hard in height. Okay, okay. My shooting stays the same. My ball handle drops a little. Hmm. Six four, six three is the average height. If I go down more, only my ball handle and my steel. So if I go up more, I lose steel, I lose ball handle. So I think going up to six foot five is the best thing you can do right here. So my dunk is sixty five. I think I can dunk now. My shooting stays the same. Ball handle lose by three, but hey, it's gonna be fine. Six foot five. If you wanna cross people up. Now, this is the big difference. If you want a speed boost, 6-3. If you want to just score, 6-5. I'm going to pick... I'm going to pick 6-5. My weight. I'm pretty sure this has an effect too. Yeah, this has a big effect. If I put my weight up, my interior defense, if I put my weight down, no bonus, but my speed and stuff. So what I'm going to do is... I'm going to keep my weight somewhere in the middle where I don't lose anything. See, my strength goes up right here. So 207 pounds, wingspan. This, this right here makes a huge difference. So if I lower my wingspan, all that goes up. If I raise it, yeah, raise your wingspan, guys. I know your shot's gonna go down 87 to 83. I say get it to 84. Your driving dunk goes up. The ball handle might go down, but I'm gonna leave it at 85, 84.2 wingspan. This is the best build. So look at all the shots I have here. I can even take the slasher takeover because of the build I have. So that's why it's perfect. You have basically all the choices offensively, shot creator, spot up shooter, playmaker, or slasher. Now, I honestly think the best one might be shot creator this year, just because people are starting to get used to stopping these spot up shooters, but when it comes to hitting those half court shots, bottom shooter is the best. So we're gonna go ahead and take that. My player build is complete. And yeah, that's gonna be it for this video right here. We got the Stephen Curry build right here. Playmaking shot creator. Go ahead, follow this build. You're gonna be set for the rest of 2K, man. I'm telling you, this build won't get patched. It won't get old. We're gonna continue on right now. Man, that's gonna be it for this video. It was constant. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching and we're going to set our overall to 99. We're going to get to testing, man. So that's going to be it for this video. If you guys want to tune into another video where I put you guys onto the best badges, stay tuned for that. It's going to drop soon. Thank you guys for watching. And I'm on the road to the cash. You niggas be mad. My niggas going to double up. And I'm on the road to the fast. Big up, I don't pass. Niggas better buckle up. Serving so fast, I might crash. And these on my ass, I'm doing a dash. No, I can't help but get in my bag. No, I'm in my bag. Get into the cash. Hey. 17, this is the better me, live but you cannot relate. No, I get some bread on me, know it's a friend of me waving this shit when I.